On this episode of Cynthia LaShawn, going to Atlanta apartment hunting. There she is. <laughs> I need this. That just like a look at that. Do you see that? What people do? Love to catch the person. The case. It's stuffed to the brim. Uh, I am nowhere near ready. That is a problem. Yeah. The way who got a watch, who got the time, I'm raising the clock. Even in my feelings, grind don't stop. Got big dreams, want big rocks. I got plans, who got talk. I just so, good morning. Today, I am off. It is Monday. Happy Juneteenth. Yay! Juneteenth, Juneteenth, Juneteenth. And today I'm off for an ultrasound appointment to scan my gallbladder because I've been having no, some pain uh, in my abdominal area. Uh, so yeah, we'll see what that's about. So what time is it? This is uh, 6.18. Yeah, it's definitely time to go because it'll probably take me about an hour, about 45 minutes really to get there. And I want to make sure I am there on time. I am now at my appointment. Just waiting outside until it's um, 7.15, which will be in about six minutes. Just finished completing the registration form. So news on the front. I will be going to Georgia, Atlanta, ATL. I will be moving. I will be moving, me and my mother, we're moving very soon to Georgia. Start of a whole new life. Yeah. Really excited. I'm so excited. Yay! I'm so excited. Um, I must say, like, I'm, I'm like so happy to have this time off. You know, I was able, I basically will be down there for about a week. Um... Well, looking at some stuff, looking at some apartments, and um, like in different areas, just to see what's out there. Um, it's so, so much cheaper, like in Atlanta versus uh, New Jersey. Well, I mean, depending. If you're in like the city of Atlanta, then no. It's going to be just as high as here. You actually probably get a little more square footage. Um, I've, I've noticed like even though the prices are about the same if you're like really within like the, the city part um, you get a lot more square footage um, but for the most part if you kind of stay like outside of Atlanta you know where you're maybe like 20-30 minutes from the city then um, the prices are way down way down you're talking about like two bedrooms in some areas you know like sixteen, eighteen hundred, sometimes cheap. Actually, it's sometimes cheaper. I've seen it as low as like around thirteen hundred. Okay, and even like three bedrooms, which honestly, right now, probably looking for a three bedroom. Even it's like a temporary, you know, like kind of a house, because uh, I I really want an extra room to be able to do my my business in. I have a whole room. I don't have to worry about kind of like setting ups. You no, know, like I definitely focusing on my business, focusing on content creating. I need this. Okay, my body needs this because like I be having too much pain and you know stressing about stuff with uh, my normal job um, though I, I, I love what I you know what I what I do and you know in healthcare being anesthesia technician um, I've had a very good career learned a lot and uh, I'm still always going to be you know a part of you know uh, the hospital that I was in uh, you know that family dynamic there so yeah but I will miss it I will miss everybody that I worked with you know I'm going to miss everyone there but this is a time for something new and I'm excited yes very 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 excited 
and um, I know it's going to take off. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I just like, I'm just can't wait to get down there, okay? Like June can't get done fast enough, okay? And then it's pretty much going to be like, you know, July. I'm going to be working maybe like another two, about like about, about two and a half more weeks. And then after that, I'm like, sorry guys, I'm done. I got to go. Because uh, we're definitely probably going to be driving down there. And I, I, I want us there by August. Yes, very much so. That's the plan. I can't wait. So I will be starting a new series. The moving, moving series to Atlanta, to ATL. That whole uh, thing, process. And, um, yeah. So, 7.15 now. Time for me to go in and check in. And, um... I won't bring the camera inside with me because that's going to be probably a little bit too weird. Because um, I'm thinking the, the examination should be quick. So, yeah, I'll be back. Okay, so that painful exam is over. <laughs> I don't know, maybe because it's more painful for me because um, I've had in the past, like, rib problems. Um, so my... Uh, my upper ribs, like the cartilage part, is just like always kind of sore and tender for me. And that area was actually like very tender. Like very, very, very tender. Because uh, she was doing a lot of pushing. A lot of hold your breath. Hold me a few times. Breath. So, that exam is over with. Um, looking about, be close to a Best Buy. Nope, can't go anywhere right now because it's too early in the morning. Yes, yeah, 8 o'clock, and I mean, I don't know, maybe it's me in the past that Best Buy used to open up earlier. Now they pretty much open up around 10 o'clock. Am I tripping to think that they actually opened up at around 8 or 9 o'clock, like way back in the past? I don't know. Uh, but yeah, eh. I just noticed I think I had like gel gel from the exam on my pants yeah so i mean <clears throat> i'm not gonna probably able to go out to another best buy later on today we'll have to see um i'm thinking i need to go to our storage later on because i have to probably get my carry-on which i almost hate carrying a carry-on because I'm, I'm just like i'm just an overpacker even though i i, I trying to not be an overpacker but i just am i'm an overpacker so i like you no know, the stuff that i like but we're gonna see because i honestly don't have any extra money right now to pay for a carry-on bag when i leave tomorrow i would like to edit this video when i'm there uh, and i'm definitely gonna need my laptop to do that so I, i'm not i don't have to worry about trying to edit everything uh once I come back, because I'm basically going to be going for like uh, six days. Yeah, I won't be back until Sunday, early. Uh, yeah, and I kind of wanted to have this video up by like the end of the week. And then, you know, start that uh, week in Georgia. That's the plan. That's the plan for that. Okay. Today. Okay, so actually at Walmart right now. Uh, um, just gotta pick up two things some bread and a can of dog food for my dog. She low key, this is be my first time actually really filming in Walmart. I think before, usually I try to like hide it in my purse, but if you wanna get used to this life, you gotta do it. This is why I can't wait to get the, uh, the smaller camera. I, think I know I'm going to get the uh, ZBE F1. Oof. I'm sore. Okay, so it's like now talking in the background, but it's not music, thank God. So I usually get uh, the this one. Can we see it? Oh, cute little Frenchie. Uh, yeah, that exam made me sore. 
I'm gonna have to lay down for a minute because um, it's so sore right now. Like it hurts to bend. Um, nope. Went down too far. Okay. I'm just gonna get uh, semi cheapo bread, but I want wheat bread. I can get the Newman. Newman own wheat bread. The honey wheat should be just fine. And I can get the whole grain, but we're gonna get the honey wheat. this area came really like to leave now almost ain't that just like a look at that do you see that what people do I hope I caught that I wasn't sure like who does that who that on camera I would just love 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 to catch the person that would do that. I would do something that childish to put a cart in front of your car. Like, why? As I say, I'm gonna miss this little area because this area had a lot of stuff in it. They have an LA Fitness going up right there. I need to go back to the gym. That's. I really need to start going back to the gym now and stop being lazy about it. Uh, but yeah, that's another thing that needs to happen. Gym and being healthy and fit and <laughs> working out. Yeah. So I saw it. I'm about to go back because I'm hungry. Excuse me. And eat my oatmeal. And okay, bye. So right now I'm getting ready for my trip. And it's literally like 3 o'clock in the morning. No. Yeah, it's 3 o'clock in the morning. It's uh, 3 o'clock in the morning, and uh, I am nowhere near ready. That is a problem. Yeah, that's a problem. I don't know why I'm just a last-minute packer, but I just am. In case, it's stuffed to the brim. I need to invest in packing cubes because I feel like if I invested in packing cubes, it wouldn't look like this. Yes, so we are right now, and um, I don't know what to do about it. Uh, let's see what happens in the next hour because I definitely need to be at the airport by 4.30 since my plane, my plane leaves at 6, but I boarding starts at like 5 20 or something so yeah i definitely need to be at the airport before 4 30. okay let me finish hello so i'm on my way to the airport i'm in my favorite uber ride my favorite uber there she is <laughs> Yeah. Uh, should be at the airport in uh, like 10 minutes and start the process of getting over. I hope my luggage is not too heavy. I hope not because, huh? Where's your big bag? It's in the back seat. Because I have that tendency to, uh, Pack. I just picked it up Okay. Uh, she says, and mom says it's not that heavy. So we're, we're hoping for the best. We can just say that my bag was overweight. Okay, let's continue. Because I put it on that weight, and it'd be all of a sudden it'd be like one pound over, and they'd be like, no, it's one pound over. Bring it back. Did you have me a pink bag? I got a little room. I, I, I need to like stuff everything. I, if I like take some stuff out and like actually roll it and put it in there nicely, then it could fit a little better. I need to invest in packing cubes. 
I hear they're wonderful. And why I don't have them, I don't know. But that's something I need to get when I come back. Because, yeah. This girl overpacks almost all the time. Alright, so I am at the airport. I'm actually going to sign off here. I will talk to you guys later. Got to get on the plane and we will start a whole new vlog. Alright, goodbye and see you in Georgia. On the next episode, on the moving vlogs to Atlanta. Oh my god. I damn nearly missed my flight. Tries, I'm still breathing right. I feel like later on I will have to get myself a breathing treatment because I had to run all that distance. So my Starbucks skin is round two. As I was walking through that apartment, uh, yeah, I, I saw I saw my I saw mouse droppings on the floor. <laughs> Running for the hills. Decatur is up and coming, like really well, up and coming. No. They've already come up. They've already come up. They've already come up. And Ooh, nice. Yeah, you have two barbecue grills over here. I'm surprised no one's out here. I think I would probably be out here because. Okay. Ooh, my business. No time for stress over bullshit. You think success is an option? I'm trying to get this shit popping like, ooh, big moves. My rules.